Hey guys, GHED here, back with another video. Today, you probably may or may not have realized 19.0.0 version of Realm of the Magog came out. And there are a few interesting things that have come out. Uh, what I do find weird though is I got on earlier this morning and there was this craze going around like, oh my god, they released the new skins and everyone was buying them and I was like, okay, I'm gonna get my hands on one of those. And I was I went to my um what is it, wardrobe? Yeah, I went to my wardrobe and I found that you couldn't buy the skins. I was really confused on like what was going on. What are these people talking about? And they were buying skins. Then I realized that Kabam had released the skins as like a consumable item, so you could only use them once. And so I bought an assassin skin which is represented as this HP pot right in my inventory. And uh, so I bought one, I was like, oh, this is pretty cool. Uh, oh, it's only got one use. So I was like, oh, I'll probably just keep it in my vault and it will become ultra rare eventually. And the description on it actually said it's gonna, uh, it's a really rare item. I've got some footage of me getting it, so I'll shoot that in a second. Um, but what really irritated me is I bought it with full life because they were really rare and everyone was selling them for tons. And I was like, well, okay. I've got to get my hands on one of these, and bam, the they came up with a message, and it said uh, the servers will be going down, etc., et 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 whatever, and what happened was uh, I couldn't get on for like a few hours. I got back on, and my assassin skin had been changed to a HP pot, and it had been erased everywhere, apparently from the game. So that was kind of irritating. I lost full life because of a stupid thing. Uh, whatever, but... The new update actually is pretty interesting. They've changed the color of this, obviously. They've changed the um, Nexus design to the Christmas theme because Christmas is coming soon. Yay. Hopefully, I will be getting a headset or something. I'm hoping. That's just what I'm hoping for. And there have been a few big changes. One being the uh, Avatar of the Forgotten King is has been released. And I'm like, oh, okay, cool. I'm going to try and find one of those. But uh, that will probably be in another video because I don't know exactly how or where they spawn yet. But it's an event in the realm and it drops the new Saturn's Dungeon, which I've already covered over um, in the comments, I think. But yeah, that's an event that drops it. Obviously, it's going to be a pretty hard event as it drops the Shatters, which is one of the hardest dungeons in the game apparently so far. Um, but, like, well, very similar to the Halloween um, update... Um, They've actually retextured a one of the bows and one of the um, swords to fit the Christmas theme again. So any tier 11 sword or tier 11 bow drops will then change to their um, the skins that they've changed them to, I guess. Um, I'll show you a few bits of footage on the forums, which um, covers over that. Just go onto the command forums and you'll be able to see it. Uh, the new skins look pretty cool, actually. Especially on the um, bow, I really want to get my hands on one of those, so I'll be playing quite a lot until I get one. So yeah, that is pretty cool. Uh, yeah, this was just a cover video just to help people who just got into the game understand what's going on. I got in, and I was like seeing all this skin stuff, and I was really, really confused, so it took me a while to figure it out. Hopefully this guys will uh, help you understand it, I guess. Uh, if you've just got on, then it won't really matter to you, but if yours has just been changed to a HG pot, they probably released it too early. That's my theory, but they might have some other reasons behind it. But, yeah, nothing much has happened besides the new event, two new items, which is just retextured tier 11 items. And they pre-release, well, they released the skins too early and had to get rid of them, apparently. I'm really hoping it's not um, a consumed by uh, one use. I really hope they sell them for gold and then you can actually buy them and they'll be permanent like every other skin. It seems a bit stupid that they would release one use items like that. But yeah, until uh, next time, I'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching. Like, comment, subscribe for more. See ya.